Amen. It's will that thy start in time. Y'all will, let's all stand and go before the Lord. Let your members so when we pray. Remember Mama Grace. He, she's needing prayer. Uh, does anybody have any other? <coughs> Sister Patsy, let's remember her. Tim and Tammy, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know about Tim and Tammy. They, they said Sean had uh, his blood pressure. He had to have some shock. Yeah, Jane. Yeah, Brother Sean, Becky, uh, we don't know if the, her papa has passed away or not. I know she was going down there. But as far as I know, I don't know yet. So we'll be praying for them. Are there any more? Remember my grandmother tonight in your prayers? Yes, say man. Keep the Parsons family in your person. Yes, amen. Remember our nation. Amen, Lord. Yep. That's a prayer in each state right there. I remember my mom, she's still under the weather, and uh, I've got a niece and nephew that members of us talked to and tried to get today. We're witnessing to them, and uh, just pray for them. I believe they're both under conviction. They said kitchen table, and they're everything they could to keep from crying, so just remember. Yes, amen. Remember my family, Richard. Yes, amen. Remember that. Anybody else? Yes, that's that. Amen. If you will, let's go before the Lord in prayer. Our blessed heavenly Jesus, Lord, as we come to you, Lord, as we're lifting up these requests, I'm here tonight, Lord, knowing you know the very need in each one, Lord.
touch my brother today, God. I wandered so aimless, my life is with sin.
Bless you, Lord.
Amen. Amen. 
Amen. Then spoke Jesus. Give me a little water, my mouth teeth won't get dry. <laughs> Bless the Lord. Amen. Then spoke Jesus to the multitude and to his disciples, saying, The scribes and the Pharisees sit in Moses' seat. Now listen to this. And therefore, whatsoever they bid you, observe that observe and do. But do not ye after their works, for they say and do not. For the blind, for the blind heavy burdens and griefs to be born and lay them on men's shoulders, but they themselves will not move them with one of their fingers. But all the works they do for our to be seen of men, they make broad their, what is that? Part. And enlarge the borders of their garments. Amen. Listen, church, we're living in a day, amen, that right at hand, we don't even know what day, what hour that God has set aside. The Bible said not even to the angels in heaven. No, Brother Bishop, that day that God has set for him to return after his people. We're living in some days, amen, that we're watching the Bible to be fulfilled. I believe in the past ten years, and I I begin to see the things that Jesus told you and I to watch, amen, and to pray. Brother Bishop, I've seen them begin to roll out. They're coming true, amen. You read on over in the 24 where he said you'll hear rumors and rumors of war. But what else did he say for the time? not yet. For this is the time of great sorrow. I believe America went through that sorrow when they closed the church. They shut the door down. Listen, just because they closed the building didn't mean for you and I to quit getting on our knees and quit looking up. But that's the time Church, I can remember when America 
used to play. I can remember them days you didn't have to lock your house. You could leave your windows wide open. You didn't have to worry about going hungry. There was always somebody offering something to eat. But what is it today? Amen. Listen, we forgot
I can remember how I had to be 10 year old. That's when Dad got saved. That they would be about eight ministers. Different churches, but eight ministers. Amen. Huh? Amen. They didn't go to the same church, but they were eight ministers of the Lord. They would be at a certain time. They would go into the woods. And brother, when they opened their voices, and they began to pray, brother Rain couldn't move what they were doing. Who could tell a mile away? What are you hearing today? Listen. I know this virus is bad, but I know Jesus is greater. Amen. Amen. The Bible tells me in these days there are going to be pestilence and phantoms in the land. They are people today that ain't even got their first unemployment check. And they're sweating bullets. Hey man, I can remember when I would get out of a job. Hey man, I know I could get on my bed. I could begin to pray. My son could come in. He could begin to pray. And it wouldn't be too long. That old telephone would begin to ring and said, I heard your husband was out of work. Tell him to be here at a certain time. Can I tell you, God's telling the child to be ready, be ready, get your clothes back, my son, and on his way, he's getting things in order, brother, the ducks are calling in line, that means the word of God is taking place in our society. Yep. Amen. Never did I think that we would live in a nation that would kill nine-month-old baby. Because the parents didn't want it. I know what the scripture says. He says, I'll get my kingdom filled even if it's through the babes. Amen. Can I tell you, it's getting cold, Brother David. Hey, he's getting on. Every day, church, you look at your clean yard, fill it up. Jesus said, blessed are those that are dead in Christ. Listen. Amen. Amen. You 
It ain't hard to figure out. Nope. You don't have to have a college education to know the Word of God. Amen. You just have to have two good bending knees. Amen. 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 Lord, you might not like the other than that, but I'll still love you anyway. Ain't nothing you can do about it. If they get back to the old path, mm -hmm. boy, I see a lot of cutting out in this right now. You're talking about foolishness coming to a halt in the house of God. Mm -hmm. uh, God knows what He's doing. Uh, amen. He knows uh, how to give you just enough rope uh, to hang yourself. Uh, just enough that you trip uh, and bow and have to call out upon Him. Amen. amen. He knows that. Yep. When Daniel cared about that decree, did it stop him? Nope. Kept right on praying. The men called him and said, okay, there's one in your, in your kingdom right now that, that's not doing what you said. He said, bring him here. Little did he know it was Daniel and King loved that day. Boy, if they loved him. Amen. Brother Bishop, he, he, he had, had compassion for Daniel. And when he stood before him, he said, Oh, Daniel, let this not be true. He said, Yeah, you can. He said, Well, I'm going to have to throw you into the lion's den. Now, they didn't feed them things everywhere on the air. How they startled yeah. to where whatever hit that cage, uh, whenever it landed uh, on the floor, uh, they were ready to pounce on it. Yeah. They found a little did they know uh, they was a man of God uh, in the hey, presence of the enemy. Amen. Little did they know uh, Daniel had a God uh, that could send an angel. Uh, Brother Bishop, we've lost 
a lot of old men of God. Amen. You talking about few. We've got few that are among us today. Amen. Amen. April last year. My dad, they threw him in the grave. And I thought what the minister preached at his funeral. You know that, was it Isaiah? Elijah or Elisha? That, that had the, had that man or brought across his shoulder. And everything that God told him, said everything you touch, it'll be healed or it'll be moved. They, they take it, they throw it in some salt water, it becomes fresh water. Amen. They take it, they lay it in the edge of the river, the river would pour. I'm talking about a God that still God today and he's about to be noticed. He's about to shake this world and the heavens with it that every child knows that he is God. Amen. I can't remember which one it was. But the other one, he told him, he said, if you can watch me go up, Amen. I'll leave it for you. Yeah. Thank you, brother. God had a chariot of fire. Pretty much in a whirlwind. My goodness. That would have been something I'd have run to, wouldn't you? <laughs> Knowing it's going to heaven, you better believe it. He said, said, if you watch me go up, he said, I'll drop it. Man, I can see that little prophet of God. Hey, man, he was young, Brother David, but he knew the man of God. He knew what the light to had. Hey, man, and he seen God work and his work. He saw it and he wanted it. Of where are we? Did you just think of the dust that was going? <laughs> Man, there he was. I believe they could have been throwing skillets at him and he wouldn't have took his eyes off the prize. Well, he kept on looking up. You ever seen the world win? I was in one, didn't even know it. How was that, brother? I was sitting in Dory Hull in Ohio. Down in the, what was it? Where, where part of Ohio? Huh? Midland, Ohio. We was in there, man, when we went in, Brother Tony, it felt like it was 200 degrees outside. Right. You know what that is. Yeah. I played it no mind. I had one thing on my mind, getting that big bowl of ice cream, <laughs> taking me a big old bite. <laughs> my, sister, my wife, my uncle, and his wife, they know what to do. They put me to where my back was I couldn't see the window. That thing went by us. I glanced and the trees were touching the ground. Now let me tell you what happened when it passed the trees. When we get attacked and that enemy hits us 
just like a tornado. We may bend, but brother, we won't uproot. We will not break. We will Amen. not stop one thing. We won't lose nothing that Jesus Christ has gave us because we know that one day we'll stand back. Amen. We'll stand back up and be recognized among the people. Man, I could just about see him laying on his ground, looking up at that, trying every way in the world not to lose focus on the mantle. Now, I want you to notice what Elijah prayed for one day. Double portion. He wanted a double portion of what he already had. Amen. Do what? Amen. He wanted more than what he had. The same spirit, the same power. He wanted it doubled, and he got it. Could you imagine? He was going up. He got to see it. I don't think it fell straight. I believe it drifted a little as it was coming back down. Yes. <coughs> and it laid on the ground. He would be with the man of God long enough that he knew how to use it. He wouldn't misuse the power of God. Because he'd been taught by an old prophet. We can do nothing but through Christ Jesus we can do all things. Amen. <laughs> Have we got to where we've forgotten how to see better God? I can't remember that. Now you don't see it too much. Child of God sick. It come up to the altar to be prayed for. If you didn't get it that night, you better watch out Sunday morning. He'll be standing right here. When if it didn't get it Sunday morning, Sunday night, he'll be standing right here. That's how you seek an God. You don't just do one and throw your hands up. You gotta continually say, gather the Lord. And I guarantee you, you say, Now they may be Catholics in this world, but I'm not kissing no man's hand. I don't care what kind of rent he's got on it. <laughs> and I sure ain't bowing before him. Amen. That's what's got us in the shape that we're in now. We bow too much to the wrong one. 
on to men instead of God. We have forgotten the ways of God. The devil has slowly pulled him away. And now we're standing vessels with no oil. Huh? Amen. Hard to shine when there ain't no guys to make it shine with. You can pretty up this outside. You can bath it three times a day. And it still looks the same. Amen. The only thing I know that can change you and I's appearance is the power of the Holy Ghost. Amen. <laughs> So quiet. I can remember, brother, 16 year old, a church house sat at the mouth of my holler, uh, still sitting there today. Uh, I could be almost uh, four miles away. Uh, I could tell you when church started uh, and when the Spirit of the God uh, walked in the church. Uh, amen. It was like somebody uh, on a microphone. Uh, Sing 
You used to, you remember when you prayed for the Holy Ghost? Did you get it one time? You had to seek to hear it. You know what they tell you today? When you tell them you're speaking, you want to speak in another tongue. Now, Mary, I'm going to tell you, whisper in your ear, you say what I tell you. Oh, gosh. That's right. I don't need some woman or some man spitting in my ear. I got enough wax in it as it is. Spirit's going to give utterance. It'll give utterance. Brother, if they're a true heart and they're true letter, the power of God, amen, and they diligently seek after Him, what does He say in the Word of God? That those that diligently seek Him shall find Him. They'll find it. Amen. I can remember when one found it in the church, everybody found it.
Amen. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Oh. Well, the preacher ain't told us to fast. Shame on you if it takes a man to tell you. That's right. You ought to have a heart that fears God that wants to fast. Mm -hmm. We have failed by saving God. And that was our Sunday school lesson. You all think you all getting it rough. You ought to be in Sunday school, aren't you, Brother Bishop? Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, Tommy. I, I believe he was throwing knives, amen. <laughs> they were stuck, stuck going that way. They were bouncing and hitting me just as well. But you know what I done when they got out of Sunday school? I meditated on all day what it was like to seek that or God. Mm -hmm. How many knows how to seek that or God? Why aren't we doing it? Why ain't we doing it? This church house would be overflowed with the people if we would use the power of God. I believe it caused a traffic jam right outside the door. I believe it could stand out there on the road and block the traffic that they'd have to hear what God had to say. Notice in this path, he said there's no unclean thing walk there in. Sometimes we need to see that or God like Daniel saw that. I'll go more than that. We ought to have it like David had it. He desired to have the heart of They make up every excuse to realize God is real. Our society, the world, our government. Mm -hmm. I don't think you can praise God one minute and drink liquor the next. Amen. It don't work. That ain't my God. Can I tell you these church houses that's packed as long as they can drink their liquor. Amen. Mm -hmm. As long as they can live as they want to live. And the preacher condones it. I pity him in hell. Yep. Cause somebody is going to be going through it, brother. Grabbing people and saying, "I'm looking for that man that told me hell wasn't real." Ah, that's the way it's going to be. The Bible said there'll be gnawing and gnashing and garnishing of teeth. Hey, that ain't a friendly place. That ain't near what heaven's like. Somebody said heaven will be worth the journey when I get home. Mm -hmm. I want you to look at what you're getting and what you had to pay for it. My goodness, I ain't never owned a mansion in my life. Come on. It's in my father's house. Now Jesus said in my father's house. I want you to let me. People overlook that part. They don't think of what they just. I said in my father's house. 
God's got a big house. Kingdom of God. And he said, in my Father's house are many mansions. If it were not so, I would have told you. But he said, I go away. And prepare a place for you. Amen. Praise the Lord. 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 secrets in her that God will tell you the answer to. Yep. He said if it's hid, it's hid from them that are lost. Mm -hmm. We get in a hurry when we read the God words God. God's famous words. We, we want to rush through it to say, I read a chapter. But did you understand what you read? That's what Philip had to ask the Enoch. Yeah. Huh? He was reading Isaiah. Oh, Philip. Now listen where Philip was at. The Bible. Philip was in a great revival. It wasn't one getting saved. It was thousands and thousands of people that praying, Brother Dave. In one day, God had him preach. said God caught him up, put him in the desert. Amen. He didn't have to buy no train. He didn't have to rent a horse. He didn't have to hire somebody to take him there. God put him there. Amen. Yep. And said when he seen him, he said, do you understand what I read? What you read? He said, how can I understand except some man teach me this is where we're like it. We don't want teaching of the Word of God. Amen, brother. That's right. I can't shout in that. I can't feel you better shout in teaching as well as preaching. Amen. That's right. It's all the Word of God. Yep. It's all the same. By the time Philip got through with that eating, he was ready for the water. He was ready for the water. Amen. The Bible said when he baptized him, that Philip was carried away in the Spirit. Amen. Scientists will never figure out how to transport. <laughs> nope. Amen. They ain't no beat me up, Scotty. <laughs> no man made anyway. It's knowing who you serve. Amen. If God wants you there, He'll get you there. Amen. Amen. He'll put you where you ought to be. Lord, if I stay anymore, brother, I'll be preaching half the night. When we, Daniel, Philip, what were they? Men of God. Who's teaching our youngins today? There's not that many old men that's in God's way. Huh? I, I used to go down to my dad's house and he had two rocking chairs sat on the porch. And my mom used to sit and rock and 
and her mom passed away. I found myself down there rocking beside him, but asking him about the ways of God. If you don't know the way, don't just ask anybody. Huh? Make sure they know God. Amen. And they'll give you the right answer. Amen. Because we're living in a time right now it's the most deceivingest time that I can put my hand on. Mm -hmm. I've never seen ministers after everybody else's flock but their own. Yep. I'll put it to you this way. If you leave, you left on your own. Amen. Yep. Amen. Nobody told you you've done it on your own. If you leave, then you that means you, you gotta come back. And God telling you not to leave. You better be careful. Amen. Brother Tommy, they can fall into the wrong hands quick. I'll show you how close the devil works. The seemeth right way. Mm -hmm. But the end thereof is, is dead. dead. Through Christ, at the end of it, is life eternal.
bread not. For my God has sent an angel. Amen. Do you understand what I just said? When Daniel was in the very need of it all, huh? there are three times a day paid off when he went into the lion's den. He got a reward, didn't he? He said, For my God has sent an angel. I'll show you that it did. The king said, come on down there, Daniel. He got them men. He said, you get these men, their family, their kin, everybody that's related to them, and you put them in there. Amen. Brother, they said the lions devour them. So see, you've got power. You just need instructions on how to use it. Mm -hmm. Amen. He followed it long enough. He watched it long enough. I'll tell you how much God loved him. There was some children out in the field of playing. And they made fun of him because he was bald-headed. And the Bible said God stick three female bears. And they they devoured their children. Because they made fun of the man of God. Man, you talking about stepping on dangerous ground. They'll tear the doors off, they'll break in our church houses, they'll ride up on our walls. But little do they know there's an all-seeing God uh, that sees what they're doing. Uh, amen. And it's not easy uh, to forget. Boy, oh, Richard, you're pretty harsh. You, you, I don't want to see bad things come. You know what I want him to do? Send them right back to that church, to the altar. Amen. You can't take him, Brother Tom. He said he'd go before you. He went before that. <laughs> he gave Elijah an instrument to prove that he was a man of God. You can read all that through the Old Testament. You know what he gave the disciples? I'm about ready to blow your mind. You better get ready. He gave them so much power the Holy Ghost. All they had to do was put their hands upon you. And if you was a child of God, you received the power of the Holy Ghost. My goodness, that was me to God. His shadow <laughs> would fall upon them and they'd be healed. Amen. You tell me we can't get it? Yes, amen. I withhold nothing good from them that diligently seek me. We're like the waves. We want it this day, but don't want it tomorrow. Toss to and fro, double minded. I can remember times my wife would, would, would wake up because I'd be preaching in the bed. She would tell me the next morning, she said, I don't know who you was preaching to, but boy, you sure was pouring in on me. I'd wake up, boy, just as frisky as I'll get at. I meant her. But they was tired. She said, she'd say, honey, you spoke in tongues all night long. Do you know there's a tongue? Now listen to this. I'm going to reveal some. There's a tongue that you can talk directly to God Almighty. Yeah. 
Cry and see. Amen. You don't know what to pray for. The Spirit will make intercession for you. Whoa! Talk directly to God. No man, the devil can't even understand it. He'll sit and scratch both of his ears trying to figure out what you're saying. You know he's a principality of the air? Mm hmm. You know he can receive your blessing? Got all forces. My goodness. I like what Jacob done. Fell asleep on a rock pile, had a dream about a ladder extended into heaven, like were angels ascending and descending. Going out and down for you and I. Tell me they don't carry the wings of the powers of the saints. You know what we try to use? Our age. I'm too old to do it now. I'm too fat, I can't get across him seat. Saying, I got 
by the living. I got to find where that little preacher read that there's a path that Jim is. I got to read where that there's a scene that's right way. Man, he said, I've been in church. I've watched the Holy Ghost shout a woman and the devil put one right beside her. You know how you can tell the difference? Holler, stop. If it's really a God, they'll no one will keep on shouting if it's God under. If it ain't, they'll stop. I've watched churches been in them and seen them. As long as the music was played, they would shout the church down. After the song was over, they'd sit down. I was like, where did the shower go? What happened? God just ain't like a light switch. You can turn on and off when you want to feel it and when you don't. Brother for David, true praise comes without that. True praise comes without music. What the preacher preach at night? I don't know. <laughs> I was so tired by the time I got through shouting, I went home. <laughs> well, I shouted so much. I know I had to stay. I didn't want everybody to smell me. I told you what to do about that. Get right in between a bunch and start hollering, do you smell that? <laughs> <laughs> That's all you got to do. Just keep shouting right on. God forbid that churches wouldn't know the Holy Ghost if he walked in and spoke. Amen. They wouldn't know it. And that's sad. Amen. They'll plan these big parties. They'll buy the best that they, that, that they offer and ain't going to get them no more God than what they started out with. You get ground with God when your knees get ground. Mm -hmm. When you come humble in your heart, huh? how many do it to get humble? Amen. Just so you could talk to me. I didn't say pray to him. You all may think I'm crazy. I don't care really. Amen. I don't do a lot of praying, but I do a lot of talking. See, I like talking to Jesus. Amen. Because he's a friend. He said, oh, I'm closer than a brother. Amen. And I can talk to him. And I like getting that humble. Before I can talk to him. And I can tell him, Lord, you know what to need. You know what to give. You know how to bless. Have you ever just talked to him? Just talk to him? Mm -hmm. Man, I've been working and about making a mistake because my mind was talking to the Lord. People probably thought I was crazy. My mouth was a moving. They couldn't get what I was saying. It don't matter to me what they think. I know who I'm talking to. And I ain't ashamed of it, brother. We ought not be ashamed. Amen. And yeah, it's happening. It's happening. Stays an old path, church. She stays an old way that's in this. I believe everybody in here had a taste of that old path. Amen. Amen. We got to get in it. We got to walk there in. They sometimes coming upon this old land. So it's going to take God for you just to stand. 
just to stay. I, I hear a man say today, it ain't a starter that gets the prize. It's the finish. Everybody starts, but there's only a few finish. I love the church. Thank God for it. Amen. Amen. If you will, I want to get us a song. I want to open the altar. I want us to find us a place. Amen. And, and let's pray. Amen. If you don't have nothing to pray about, pray for me. Amen. But pray for your church. Amen. I'd love to see the movement of God that, that, that's been unreal.
Nothing can beat the goodness of God, that's for sure. 
sugar. And it's so much better than us wanting to deserve on a daily basis. I know looking back on some of my past failures, stumblings, and where I've fallen, I thank God for His grace, Amen. His mercy. He didn't have to extend the hand of grace to me and any mercy and forgiveness. Yeah. I wouldn't blame him one bit if he didn't consider where I was at in my life. You know, the Lord loved me enough to forgive me and bring me right back on into the fun. Yeah. Who's got that next one for Jesus? Just I thank the Lord for being here tonight and the Good. message Brother Richard gave us. And, uh, I went to the doctor Wednesday because I didn't get to come to church because I had a sinus infection. So I went to the doctor and the doctor gave me some kind of antibiotics and they told me to shut my kidneys down. You know, if I take so much of it, I take it. So I just started waiting to take it. And I'm praying, you know, and I asked her, uh, she said, well, do you want a COVID test? And I said, well, I don't have no COVID. And she said, what do you mean? I said, because I don't. She said, well, how do you know? I said, because the Lord's told me I was on. She said, well, so you ain't going to take no test? And I said, yeah, I'll take it. I said, but can you tell me when to come back? She said, in a day or two. So this is uh, Sunday. No, I've not heard nothing. <laughs> Amen. So y'all pray for me. Yeah, I know what I'm doing. The power of Jesus Christ is the beautiful spot, not the plain bit. The power of life and death, right. death is in the tongue. And uh, those that eat the fruit there are going to enjoy it. Right. You know, sometimes we... We've got to speak, speak those blessings in the church. Yes, we do. Well, she asked me, she said, uh, God, she 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 said uh, where's your mask? Because I had to give me one. Yeah. I said, well, I don't wear no mask. Yeah. And she said, why don't you wear it? I said, well, I've got somebody watching over me. Uh -huh. no what a God. What a God. Amen. Amen.
because I didn't know what that sound was that was in them pines. Yeah. Later through the years, I found out that was in them pines. Well, yeah, it was something to be afraid of. I was the old men of God in the afraid yes, because I had to walk by it every day going home from school, and I would hear them old men in the praying, but terrified me. But that wasn't nothing but the devil to make me fear. Yeah. But it's also the Lord made me know what I needed. But I just thank God that them old men that prayed that then is what's got us where we're at tonight. Yeah. I Amen. just love the Lord. I yes. thank you for everything He's done for us. Yes. I thank the Lord for being here tonight. It's always good to be in the house of God to have fellowship, be able to come together with one mind, going Amen. forward, agreement, draw near to God, lift Him up. Uh, thank the Lord for that message that He ministered through um, Brother Richard. Uh, I like hearing some of the stories of the old timers. Yeah, kind of yeah, yeah. You know, just, just things of the older days in general. Uh, yeah. You, you really look back on that and you just sit back and listen to a lot of y'all stories, the way things were back then to what it is now. And we wonder why we don't see the, the major, mighty moves of God and the Spirit getting out forward. It really, really does show that you do have to make an honest effort to, to really, really diligently see things of yep. that nature. And we're really slack and bad. Right. <laughs> I, I'm not, I mean, it's just not, I, I'm, I'm, I'm talking about me as well. I, I consider, consider where I used to be, where I need to get back to. You know, I'm, I'm kind of ashamed of myself. Yep. I really am. Yeah. I know that ain't pleasing to God either. I don't know why he strives with me. <laughs> I, I do I do thank uh, the Lord for that message in a way it's, it's an eye opening experience. Yep. We all need some chastening and directing. You know, um, if, he didn't, if he didn't love y'all, the Lord, he wouldn't, he wouldn't preach hard messages. I think a, a scripture comes to my mind, the book of Proverbs, blessed are the wounds of a friend, but deceitful are the kisses of an enemy. Yeah. Somebody yeah. has a true love of God in their heart for you. They're going to tell you what you, you need to hear, not what you want to hear. Right. Too much ear tickling going yeah. on in this day and age. For real. Amen. I, I thank the Lord for, for Mother Richard. Thank the Lord for all of you. Yeah. I don't know where I'd be at if I hadn't came back to this church. Thank you. I have found this church, so what I ought to say. Thank God for leaving you here, brother. Yeah. You better help me. I thank the Lord for one more preacher. Thank God what he's done for me. And I love him, love the church. Yes, Lord. And there's a lot of things, you know, like I say, a lot of things we don't understand. We just live with them. And it's hard, it's hard sometimes. Yes. People, you know, are way to do the church people and, mm -hmm. and the Jews, they were, way to do them poor Jews over there, I watch it once in a while. Man. That's terrible. Yeah. Starved to death, froze to death. Man. They don't care. No. People don't care no more. Mm -hmm. You can be going down the road. If, I don't care what I'm at or what I'm doing, whether I know them people or I don't know them. If they got that term <coughs> stuck out, I'll give them a ride. I figure if I get killed, I'm better off. You know, <laughs> hey, the Lord, you're better off. You're better off. You're yeah. better off. Just go on. Amen. I got nothing for us. Amen, brother. Amen. Praise the Lord. Praise Yeah, I'll, I'll probably take one of that. Okay. Wow.